Hi there, I'm Andy Hillier and today I'm going to teach you how to play Six Feet Under by Billie Eilish. Now this came in as a request on one of my other videos, um, so if you've got any requests put them in the comment section down below. Uh, and also if you could like and subscribe to the channel that would be awesome. Okay, Six Feet Under, it's pretty easy, we've got a verse, we've got a chorus, uh, and we've got a, like, a middle eight, which is a kind of variation on part of the chorus. Okay, so straight in to the verse, it starts off with B minor, which is your first finger on A2. Second finger on B3, third finger on D4, and little finger on G4. Uh, you can bar your first finger across um, to the E string, but it doesn't matter if you don't play that E string either. Okay, so that's B minor, next chord, nice and easy, it's an A chord, just first finger on D2, second finger on G2, third finger on B2. Playing from the A string down on both those chords. And then we've got a G chord. Third finger E3, second finger E3 nearest to your face, first finger on A2. Okay, and then it goes back to an A chord. So the first two bars go B minor, A, G, A. Then the next two bars are almost the same. It goes B minor, A, and then G for a whole bar. So the whole of the verse, let's play that line, ready? Um, it actually repeats round twice. Um, but we'll just play it once for now. Here we go. Ready? One, two, three, four. B minor. A. G. A. B minor. A. G. Two, three. And then it would repeat uh, and play through the whole of that. So that's the verse. Just does it twice. And then it goes to the chorus. Um, which the first, so there's two lines of the chorus. Now the first line of the chorus is almost identical as the verse. The only change is, if you can see there, on the fourth bar of that line, it's an E minor chord, which is just A2 and D2. With your second and third fingers. Uh, so that just replaces it was a G on the previous line. So let's play the chorus then. Here we go. One, two, three, four. B minor. A. A, B minor, A, E minor, two, three, four. Then it goes to the second line of the chorus, which starts with a G chord. And this G chord is going to last for three beats. So it goes one, two, three, A, B minor, two, three, four. Then G, two, three, A, B minor, A. So it just plays the G for three beats and then uh, the A for one beat, going straight to B minor uh, for four beats. G for three beats again, A for one beat. Then it goes B minor for two beats, A for two beats, and then G for four beats. Let's just play that line. One, two, three, four. G, two, three, A, B minor. And then that jumps back to uh, the verse, which would be like the B minor chord. Um, on the second chorus, it plays both of those lines of the chorus, but then it doesn't play that last G chord. What it does is it goes to the like a middle eight part. So basically, it'll go the G A B minor, G A B minor A, and then straight to this uh, middle eight, which is doing G for two beats, A for two beats. B minor for four beats, G for two beats, A for two beats, B minor for two beats, A for two beats, G for four beats, and then it goes back to the chorus of the song. And that's all there is. So you've got the verse part, um, and then you've got the two lines of the chorus, it does the verse again twice round, and then it does the second chorus, which is the same as the first chorus, minus the last G does the middle eight, goes back to the chorus, and that's the whole song for you. Relatively easy song to play, providing you can play that B minor, shouldn't have any problems. Well, thanks for watching this little video. If you've enjoyed it, if you could give me a like, if you could subscribe to my channel, I'd really appreciate that. 
uh, share the video, help me out, that'd be awesome. And just put some comments, just if you liked it, say you liked it, let me know where in the world you're from, just say hello, that'd be awesome. Thanks for watching this, I've been Andy Hillier, and I'll see you next time.